Hey ho, it's me, ya boy again. <laughs> Look what I got running this time. Oh, yeah, baby, retro art on the Pi 4. And even better, I managed to add one extra core to this. Yabos! Oh, and I also got uh, some SNES games as well to show off. But that'll be that in a minute. Yabos! Hold on. So hard to do this. One hand and then... Your home tie. There we go. Let's load up a game. Let's try Marvel vs. Superheroes. Oh, maybe not. I just gotta load the ISO up. Oh, interesting. It wigged out. She wigged out. That's weird because I, I got it. Maybe, maybe I just need to load it off here. Let's try Mega Man. I'm doing the wrong call, that's why. Bodies. Voice thinks it's PlayStation. Bless it. Bless it's little art. Boom, baby. I don't know why the interface thing's gone. I had the frame thingy on there. But yeah, we're going in full screen. Looking good so far. Frame skip even works on here, but it's kind of jittery, so I wouldn't recommend it. Ready. That's not bad, is it? I can't stretch high enough. I don't know what the frame rate is supposed to be because I just had it on there, didn't I? So that you can have it full screen. Full screen. Hold on. Might be um on screen display notifications. Display frame rate, there we go. That's much better, isn't it? For the 2D games, at least. And that's off, this is running off my flash drive. I told ya! I told ya! <laughs> anyway, let me load up another one. Load that content, load that content. Out. Try that. Don't mind that, is it? See? Makes it crash. How strange. Let's try loading the course. Just double check. Right, core content. See? There we go. We need to go to. So, it doesn't even want to save this particular configuration because it crashed this one. 
Display the frame rate. Do 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 do. Resume the freaking game. Do. This isn't without the frame skip on, by the way. But minus better. I mean, look, it's forty-two this time round. Let me try the frame skip. Frame skip on now. Look at that, ain't that better? Leave me alone, Hulk. <laughs> Stop bullying me. No bully. Drawing juggling loop. Fall else fails, hit him with the same move. Go away. Go away. Go away, Hulk. Leave me alone. Stop bullying me. Ultimate cheese. Quick work, soldier! <laughs> I wonder if I have Bomberman on here still. Probably not. So the only one I got is Panzer Dragoon 3. Now this one glitches. Boy, yeah, boost. Look at that, already an improvement on the intro, right? Almost full speed. And even this improved, because there's like a high resolution menu. And I enabled the four cores on here. You almost think this game was running full speed. See, this is where the frames get really starts to hurt though. But I mean, it's not the worst. This is overclock, don't forget. Because I've got it on a freaking giant fan, but. That's what I'm saying. But you can see, yeah, like with the frame skip and that. Because it's more heavy. It glitches more. I mean, come on. That's a huge improvement. Let's put, test turn the frame skip off. And then you'll see what it loads runs at. So this is the sense I have force HLE, RAM, 
pencil threads. So you know, it's a huge improvement. Overall, I mean, you're still getting like 40, almost 50 frames per second with incomplete drivers. I mean, I assume they're incomplete. It is running in GL mode now. So I still think there's plenty more that you could do to improve this, I, I reckon. This is an old version of Retroarch as well. This is Bobboy 7.3. But this is the latest. Yeah, Bolsi Core. I just sort of copied over. So, yeah. Yeah, boy. I mean, it's still kind of playable now, still. Even with the slowdown. I'm going to just do some snizz in a minute, but I'll do that as a separate vid to upload. <laughs> 